today's subscription spot, we're having a look at the NerdBlock subscription box for the month of June. Contained in this black box with one lone bloodied hand is your destination for everything horror-inspired uh, collectibles. You get things from t-shirts, collectibles, statues, and so much more, and you can have this delivered to your house every single month by going to www.horrorblock.com. You can also go to facebook.com forward slash horrorblock and Twitter at horrorblock as well. Uh, once again, one of my favorite subscription boxes. I do always love horror. Well, I love horror related stuff anyways, but I always love going into the mailbox. I don't actually crawl in. It's not like the size of a cave, but I do always like going to my mailbox and finding the horror block for the month. Without further ado, I do. Let's get this opened up. I got Hank here. And let's cut the front tape of the horror block. Let's find out what goodies we have inside this month. First things first, why don't we have a look at the t-shirt? Don't open, dead inside. Oh, I just did. I just did. Opening up, the first thing we're gonna come across is a t-shirt. The t-shirt says, survive the night. I'm thinking that's a reference to the purge. That's my guess. Purge 2. Wasn't as good as the first one, but uh, Purge 2. Still a good movie. Survive the Night t-shirts. That's a good way to always start. We also have inside a Cthulhu. It's the one word that Spot loves to say. Remember when I used to say Chulu and Pothulu? The Cthulhu. It's the Cthulhu Mini Plush. You can go to www.infinitefan.com little Cthulhu stuffed plush. Little wings. Ah! That's not actually, I think, what a Cthulhu sounds like. That's more like an eagle, which is actually what I seem to think every creature sounds like. All sounds like an eagle. It's kind of like the old 70s cartoons, like Rocket Robin Hood and stuff. Everything kind of sounded the same. Did you notice that? What is this? We have the alien silicone ice tray. What? What? Yes, silicon tray. You can make your very own alien eggs. You can make them out of ice. You can make them out of jello. You can make them out of chocolate. I'm trying to think of other things you can make with this silicone tray. It comes from the folks over at uh, Cotabakia. I didn't realize actually that they made silicone trays. That's very cool. On the back, alien silicone ice tray. Cotabakia.co.jp. If you want to check out more Cotabakia, they're big into statues. That's their, that's their meat and potatoes. We also have, oh, look at this. I don't think, I might actually have to reference this. I don't think I actually have done a review for this Scream Ghostface retro reaction figure, I should say, from the folks over at Funko. That sounds to me like a segue, because I think I've done all of these, and I did this one. I don't think I did Pinhead, and I don't think I did Ghostface. I might actually just do this guy as a separate review, just because Ghostface is so cool, even though this series is probably gonna <coughs> suck. I don't know why. It sounds like I'm strangling somebody. It's not gonna be very good. The mask doesn't look like it's gonna be very good. We also got ourselves a magazine. I like magazines. The new issue of Rue Morgue, Horror and Culture and Entertainment, American Psycho, turns 15. I actually saw American Psycho in the theaters. Looking back on it now, I'm surprised I was even able to get in. That's a very violent movie. But American Psycho, one of my favorite movies. And we, of course, can flip through this. I know sometimes this has backfired for me because I flip through this and then there's something grotesque. There's nudity or something like that. Anyways, there's Rue Morgue. Rue Morgue, guys. Rue Morgue. This is something that right after I finish opening these bad boys up, I always end up sitting down and enjoying my issue of Rue Morgue. All right, let's have a look at what we got in this month. Survive the Night t-shirt. Uh, it'll take you uh, all you've... What's, it'll take all you've you've got to survive the purge. Hmm. But you're at least going to be able to do it in style if you love this shirt. Check out shirtpunch.com for more great, unique, limited edition horror shirts. They have four new designs every 24 months. Or 24 hours. Can you imagine? New shirt every 24 months. People would just be sitting there just... When, Look at the calendar. It's a long wait for that next t-shirt. 
I know Spot sometimes has to wipe his eyes. We have the Ghost Face Reaction figure from Funko, the Aliens Ice Cube tray from Kotobukiya, and Rue Morgue, the issue for this month. And there is the Cthulhu plush. This is a Leanna Vamp stamp. She approves this Cthulhu. We've summoned a cute incarnation of this Edrich God for inclusion in our own dark, dark altar. Don't let this delightful expression fool you. While Cthulhu's Cthulhu may not be a deity to trifle with, it's certainly one of... It's certainly... Ah, oh, my eyes! <laughs> one that can be played with or left to its own devices. It's up to you. There you go, guys. Certainly a fantastic haul once again from the folks over at Horror Block. If you guys would like to have Horror Block delivered to your door every single month... You can click the link down below and you can subscribe to Horror Block. Today's subscription spot, we're having a look at Horror Block for the month of June. Thanks for watching as you always do, guys. And stay tuned. Spot's going to have more subscription spots heading your way where we have a look at other things that can come to your door every single month. Like this Cthulhu? Maybe like this Cthulhu. Thanks for watching. See you next time.